Hey, it's Rilly Girl. Welcome back to House Flipper Friday. Today I'm working in the living room area and I still see that there's some dirt and things around in here, but I'm not exactly sure where, so I'm gonna run around here. I've worked in this bathroom already, but apparently there's still dirt I can't see somewhere. It's not cleaning this spot off here. There. Must have been on the old stuff I had in here. I don't know. But anyway, that's fixed. And I think that's it now as far as dirt. We should be good. Oh? Oh, here in the stairwell somewhere. I see it. Am I going to be able to get it from here? There it is. All right. So let's run back up here. Close this door. If it'll close. Did it close? No. Why did you not close? Closed. Jeez. So today, I'm going to finish the upstairs area here. I like the size of this room, but it's laid out really weird because of all these doors to all these other rooms. So I've got to decide where I want to put couches and TVs and all of that. This entranceway is just so weird that it just pops right into the house. No rhyme or reason. So, what do I want to do? I think I'm going to start with paint. Pick a paint color. Alright. So I've got copper coin in the kitchen area. I bet that this light vanilla would look nice, or that delicate cacao. Let's see what this would do. I don't want it to be too horribly different. Let's see. I think that's pretty. I'm gonna go with this deep color. I like that. Probably have to move this thing a little bit. This is a big room. And I think I'll go ahead and paint inside the window frames as well. I'm gonna move this closer to this end since I'm over here now. Get that? I already did. Good. This looks like I'm gonna have to try to get those painted because of the way the door's sitting in there. That's better, I think. And I don't know if I can get this. No, I can't get that. Okay, where was I? Over here. We've got all kinds of colors going on in this house. What? Why is it not... Can't get it to paint all of it there. There we go. This is a nice deep color. I like it. Okay. I'm gonna need some more paint soon though. Really big room. It's amazing to me that the window frames of this house weren't messed up. Oh, did I run out of paint? Yep. Okay, gotta get some more. Whoop, oh, wrong.
wrong thing. I always hit the wrong thing. Come back and have my... There we go. I thought I was gonna have the big mallet or, or big um, hammer in my hand. Okay. Get the rest of this done. I like how it looks from the transition into the kitchen there. The colors. They complement each other pretty well. This is gonna look so much better. Once I get the floor switched out, it'll look like a whole new room. Looks like I need to do the same thing I did on the other side. Fix these little pieces that are showing white here. Oh, is it already full? I guess so. Alright, that should be it. That looks so nice. I like the transition. So let's do something with this awful floor. Um, I'm thinking a dark wood in here. So maybe this. Let's see what this would look like with the walls. I'm just going to do it right here for now until I can see. Oh, I like that. That looks very pretty. So I'm going to run it there. I'll come back and fix these. Uh, I don't want to go that far. That should be it then. Oh yeah, look how nice and dramatic that looks. Whoa! Fancy! I like it. Alright, so now it's time to put in my furniture. We have two of these ugly units over here on the wall. I fixed them, but as I look at it, I don't think I need two. I wonder if I can get rid of one of these. Uh, but which one would I want to get rid of? Well, maybe that one? Let's see. There we go. Look at that. That's better. There's no need to have two of those things in here. I'd like to just take that one out too. It doesn't really need it, but I guess I'll leave it. Okay, so now I want to go ahead and figure out the placement of the living room area here. That door there goes outside to the little back porch here. Hmm. That one uh, cabinet that I got rid of over here, I think it would be fine right there now. The way I have it painted, I think it would look good. Maybe I'll find another one that I want to put there in its place. Okay. So let's go ahead. We'll start with a couch. So I want to do sofas. Something light like this pretty elegant sofa would look nice. This probably is not going to come in a color other than chocolate. Nope. What do we have? Let's try this light color. Oh, that's a nice big couch, isn't it? Very nice. Uh, how do I want to do this? Maybe over here. Pull it over a little more this way so it's away from the door some more. It's not going to be perfect under that window, but I think that's okay. Let's see. I need to have a TV stand. It would be kind of cool to be able to do a corner one. I don't think I've ever done a corner one. 
So there is a corner there, that one. I like that light color. I want to see what this is going to look like. It may not fit in that corner because of the unit there. And I might take it out. I'm wondering if I would like that there in the corner. It would have the TV where it would be blocking both those windows. If I did a regular TV stand, it would just be blocking the one window. Let's see. I might I might change my mind and just go with this. I like that light color. Let's put a TV on and see what that looks like. There it is. Okay. That looks good. I think that's probably going to be better. I think I like that better than blocking the corner. I think that'll be nice. So we need a coffee table for sure. So let's see. Tables, I guess? Yeah. What kind? I like this one. What does this look like? That might be pretty. That's pretty good. It almost looks pinkish to me, but I think it'll be fine. I'm not I'm not too worried about that. Now as far as tables for beside the couch, that's gonna be tricky. What do I like? I don't want it to be horribly huge. I wish I had something that matched that. So, what color? I like the dark wood and the light wood look. So I think I'm going to do that again over here. If I can get it to fit. It's not quite enough room, so I may end up Oh, I don't even know if I move the couch at all. Am I even able to move it? No. So let's try putting that there. Now can I move the couch a little? Yeah, it moved it a little bit. Now let's see. I still don't think I'm going to be able to get one in there. It's just a little... Oh, wait. Here we go. It, I thought it wasn't going to work at all, but it finally did. That's great. I think that'll work. Okay. So now it's a matter of finding cute little lamps to go on our couch here. Let's see. I like these lamps. And I think I'll do that. Let's get over here. Yeah, that's really a nice little lamp. The other one though, I don't I don't know what the difference is. So I want to look at this one too. I'm gonna to put that one on the other one and see if I like that one better. I don't I don't I can't really tell what the difference is other than there's a price difference. Okay, so oh it looks like this one's open at the top, maybe? And that one's closed at the top? Okay. Well, I guess I'll just switch to the other one. I kind of like it better, this one. Alright, let's turn that on. Let's see. Oh, that's cute. That's starting to look nice. Now, before I go any further, I need to put my stuff in my windows here. I'm going to go with the open blind. Wish it were this easy to put blinds up in real life, too. I would do that in a heartbeat. It's not easy for sure. Whoa, I'm opening the window. Um, We had changed some of them. We have big plantation blinds. And we had to change some out because they were looking pretty grimy. 
And oh my gosh, it was ridiculous trying to get those things. You would think that when you already had the same blinds up that it would be easy to put the new ones in, but it really wasn't. They didn't match up right. We had to redo everything and that was a pain. There, that's starting to look really nice. So I want to pick a curtain. Um, I may have to go short, but I kind of like long too. So I want to see what it's going to look like over the couch. It may look silly and I may have to change it. Now I have to pick color too. I wonder if that little gray flower would look pretty. I don't think I want to go gold. And I don't want to go that really dark brown there. These other colors are crazy. And I have white, but I've done white in the other rooms. So if I can get away with something else in here, I just want to see if this would look good. It may or may not. Oh, okay. So because I have stuff in the way now, I can't put up a blind. So I'm going to have to move stuff, I guess. Whoop. Let's see. Let's get out of that. Gotta move my couch. Hopefully that's all I have to move because I was able to get everything else put in where I wanted it. That's so silly to me that you can't put curtains up when you have something in the way. Even if you're standing on the couch like I was. In real life you can stand on your couch and hang curtains. <laughs> that's a little silly. That actually looks pretty, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it with the long here because of the couch. Let's see how far back I can get the couch because of the curtains. Let's try. I'm going to get on this and see if I can whoop, scoot it just a little further back and see what happens with the curtain. May not be able to. It doesn't look like I can go anywhere with it at all. So that would be it right there. Let's see. I'll probably want to move some stuff out, which is fine. Like, I need to move this out. Is my... Yeah. Oh, gosh. There we go. It almost fell. If I moved them out, I think we'll be fine. This would have to go out a little bit further, too. Which is fine. All right, let me move this thing first. I don't want to drop it and break it. About there, I think, is where I have the other one. I may have to adjust it. Yeah, I don't have this one out as far. I think I like it a little further out. Oh, you know what? Did that break? It did. Because it tipped backwards, it broke. Hold. How do I dispose? Oh, I gotta do that. So it's worthless when it tips. That happened to me in another house, and that was very frustrating to me. That's better, I think. So now I've got to buy a new lamp because that one broke. Standing lamp and it was this one, I think. Yes. Okay. So that's better. I like that. That looks good. Now I'm going to continue with my curtains. Get these on. A glass sauna door, that's cool. I've never really just looked through the whole tab. It's definitely not windows here. You can put sliding doors, but they have to be internal. Because as far as I know, you can't do anything with external, external doorways. Unless maybe you wanted to... I wonder if you could change this. No, because you can't tear these walls down. So you couldn't change that to a sliding glass door if you wanted, which would be kind of cool. It would be nice to have a sliding glass door to look out in the backyard. But all those doors seem to be for internal things, unfortunately. Maybe someday. Okay, it's that one. I may end up having to move the television too. We'll see. Sometimes it's nice to see the layout of your room before you put up your curtains, so then you can pick your colors. But the way this game wants you to do it is it wants you to put your curtains and blinds up first and then put all of your other stuff. See? I don't I don't know why it's like that. It's 
Not like that in real life, so it shouldn't be that way in a game. <sighs> okay. I guess in the game it's all about collision boxes. There we go. Let's put these things back. I didn't drop my TV, so we should be fine. I want to see what it looks like directly underneath that window. I think I might like that. Almost directly under the window. I don't think I want to go any further on that, actually. Because it's already not centered with the couch here. I'm almost wondering if I want to center it. I think I might. I think that would be okay. So let's move it. And put it right here. Come here, TV. How's that? Okay, that's on there good. Okay. I think that looks pretty nice. I just don't like that radiator. So maybe maybe we could hide it a little bit with a chair? I don't know. Let's see. I want to use this chair somewhere. Maybe a little different color. Oh, that's a pretty color. Let's see if that would look good here. Just a pop of color in the living room there. Look at that. That's pretty nice. I think I could go with that. But I still feel like I can see that thing really well. So maybe a plant or something in front of it. Let's do plants only. Here we are. Let's try this one. Get up here. That's good. That looks nice. Okay. I would like a little carpet. Possibly. Floor. Carpets. But I don't know what color I would want to put in here. I think I have this in the kitchen. I don't know if this would go good with what I've got going on in here, though, so I want to look at it and see. Is that straight? There we go. That actually doesn't look bad. That's pretty even, too. How'd that happen? I think I'll go with that. That just dresses it up some. That's very nice. Okay, I'm liking this so far. What else do I need in this little living room area? It would be nice to put in a bookshelf somewhere. Maybe there. I might do that. We almost have enough room to put like a little dining room table here. I don't know. I might do that. So let's go to cabinets again or cupboards. And just look through these a bit here. I like this tall bookshelf. We've got a lot of light wood going on, so I'd kind of like to stick with the light. I'm not sure that I like that enough, though. It's kind of big for that spot, isn't it? Let's see if there's something else that might... Make it a little better. I like this one too. That might be better. And that actually fits right here. I can't tell how straight I have it on the wall. That looks pretty good. So, when you come in... You see the living room here, and there's a bookshelf there, which is fine. So let me see if I think I want to put a little bit more of a formal table out here. I don't know. This is a really nice big open area right here that 
we could possibly do something with if I can find something pretty. That we have in the kitchen, but we could always do a darker, prettier version out here. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to like that. That's going to block everything off. So I'm going to say no to having any kind of a uh, dining room table out here. My mind is working. What do I want to put here? We do need an area for a desk. So maybe I could do that. I don't know what colors. That one there might be good. Yeah. Then we need a chair. And I'll probably go with this one. I'll do it in black. And of course now we need to put all of the desk equipment on there, so... I'm going to do the smaller of the two monitors. That HD one is really cool, but it is almost as big as the television set. And I don't, I don't think I want to use that. Wait, let me see. I want to make sure I have this. That's pretty good, I'd say. Um, I could even put this chair more middle of the desk, and I think I will. Is that better? I think I have it too far over now. Trying to get it straight where I want it. That's good, I think. So then this can go more... A little more centered. Alright, let's see what else. We've got to have the keyboard and we've got to have our little computer piece here. But I don't know where I want to put it. I guess I could stick it right here on the end of the desk if it fits. It kind of hangs off. So maybe down here. And then the keyboard. And a mouse. Kind of have to have a mouse. Okay. That's looking pretty good. Maybe we could go all out, go all out and put speakers on here too. Those would fit. Let's do another on the other side as well. What the heck? And over here, can we fit this little DVD player by the TV? No. it's It looks like it would fit perfectly underneath there, just you can't. Won't let me. Okay. Never mind, they don't get a DVD player with the house. What else? Anything else in here I want to use? Ooh. You know what? Let's put a coffee maker in the kitchen here somewhere. Right here's a good spot for it. Who doesn't want a coffee maker? I'm thinking that's probably it. I wonder if a ceiling fan would be nice in here. I've never put a ceiling fan up in any of my houses, I don't think. Is there any other color? No, that's it. It's kind of cool. But I don't know. I, I don't think I'm gonna. Never mind. No ceiling fan. So let's do lights over here. And I want to do ceiling halogens, I think. Just to have a little bit of something. I don't think I need like a little chandelier thing over top of the thing here. Unless I get one of these. I want to see what this would look like. Kind of over here centered a little bit. Uh, I don't think I like it. I want to look from this angle. It brightens it up nicely, but I'm not sure that I like it. It's definitely not where I wanted it to be. Still too far. Let's go this just a little. That's more centered.
Hmm. I don't think I like it enough to keep it. I think I'll just go with my tried and true halogen lamps that I like. Because they're kind of out of the way. But they lighten things so nicely. Let's just do by many and I can stick a few here and there. Um, let's see. Let's put one right here. Near the bookshelf. Ooh, that lightens that up nicely. Okay, let's see this. That does look really nice and bright, doesn't it? That's very pretty. I feel like I could probably put another one here. Let's do by mini again. Maybe I could stick a few more out. So, about right there. Don't really need any over here because of those little lamps. But I feel like we need something here. Whoop! I got the wrong thing. That's good. That helps to brighten things up a little bit. Very nice. So this should turn everything off, except for the little table lamps, which is fine. Yeah, that's a big difference. I like that. It's looking really cute. I feel like we're using this space better by having a couple of things over here. The way that these doors are, I think I'm going to just leave this big area open. I don't want to put anything to block our paths to any of our other rooms in here, including the living room. So that'll be that. I just need to do some little bit of decorations here and there now. So I will work on that here next. Let's see. We need something definitely on our bookshelf. But I wanted to see if there's something here I would want to put out. Maybe little candles on the coffee table. Get to a better angle there. That was very bright from the light above. Right. Let's see what else. Anything else? We can put a little book here too. Okay. That's good. Now, I don't think there's anything else I'm going to want to use here. Maybe we could put out a welcome mat at the front door. I don't know. I'm kind of like, I like them, but I don't like them. But I guess I'll use it. Maybe I'll put one over here too, so people know when they come in what the entrance and exit doors are. That works. Okay. Now, pictures! I'll worry about that bookshelf in a minute. I think I want to go do pictures and I can actually put a couple on that bookshelf too. Really. I like these pictures and I know you can import your own, but I don't really want to. I'm just going to use what the game gave me because I don't really have a lot of pictures that I would want to put in the game. And I don't really want to use pictures that you can find on Google because a lot of pictures are copyrighted and I'm not going to get in trouble for doing that. That's kind of cute. I like it. I feel like I need something on this wall too, but I don't know if I want a picture. I might do uh, the other... And put that little shelf there with something on it. That would be really cute. I like that angle. I just gotta find... I like that color. That's probably gonna be it. What's the difference between them though? This one's kind of nice too. Let's just do that one. And I wonder if you can get a plant on here. I can't remember if I've ever tried. So I'm going to try. Decorations, plant. Can I get this little guy on there? No. Yes. He, he popped up there for a second. Oh, but I think he's going to go through the wall, isn't he? Let's see. No. Actually not. Well, cool. I'm going to jump back up here. Ugh, so I can see better. That's good. 
Perfect. So then I just want to put a couple more things out here, maybe a few vases. Um, which one of these? I don't know. Not a huge fan of that color. So maybe the other one. I, I used that one in the kitchen, but I think it would be okay to use it twice. It's not going to hurt anything. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's cute. That just adds something there that it just needs on the wall. I think we're fine over here. Maybe I'll put something above this as far as a painting. I really like that one right there. That is so pretty and it's fall right now. So, I mean, it's appropriate. Let's see what it looks like though. I don't want it to be way too high. I think that's a good height. That looks cute. It almost looks like a TV screen, doesn't it? That's kind of cute. I like that. All right, anything else I want to put out? Make sure those are right side up too. Yeah, they look fine. Maybe a couple pictures on these little walls. That's going to be really big. This one might be better. It's smaller, but I think it'll be fine. Which wall? Let's do like a couple here. I like to do little photo collage type things. So maybe we could put a couple of these over here. Come on. Could do one more smallish one. Like that. That's kind of cute, but I think this needs to go up a little bit. There we go. So we have a couple of things on the wall there. And then right here, let's just do a bigger picture, maybe? Um... I don't think I've seen that before. Oh, some of these are new. That's nice. Oh. Is this big? Ish? No, not very. I'm gonna keep looking. I really like the wild horses. I know that one's big. So let's put the wild horses there. They really look nice with that wall. I feel like I need a plant there too. I could do this all day, putting stuff out. Um, I like these pencil plants. Or whatever you call them. To me, they're a pencil plant. It's not in the wall, is it? No. Maybe a plant over here. What the heck? Can never have too many plants. Nice and cheery. That's better. It's not going to look like it's going through the wall. We'll make sure it's not going through the fridge too. Good. All right. Let's see. Aww, it's so cute. So let's stick a few things on the bookshelf, and that should be it for upstairs. Yay! I love this little guy on these bookshelves. Maybe we'll go with a blue. Let's see where we can put him. If he fits. He's not going to fit on this one, unfortunately. He's a little too tall. Oh, that's sad. That would have been cute. So no plant. We'll have to do pictures like this. Let's do this odd picture. I guess it's a flower. It, yeah. It almost looks like it could be a mushroom, but it's a flower. Maybe a hydrangea or something. Let's just put one more down here somewhere too. So we have a couple of things decoration-wise on this shelf. Uh, where am I going? Other, I want to find some books. I've never looked in the new Halloween tab. I might do that just to see. I don't think I want anything from it in my house, but I could at least look at it and see what's there. I've never done it, so that might be kind of fun. I'll do that here in a minute after I get a couple things out. Put it at an angle a little bit. 
here. And maybe just a couple of these. Is that big? I want a small one, I think. Well, that might work. Let's see what size it is. That's not a bad size. Let's do another medium black one down here lower, maybe, if it lets me. Okay. There we go. Just a little bit of decoration on the bookshelf there. All right. I want to look at the Halloween stuff because that just <laughs> looks like it would be fun to look through. Aww. There's an old TV even. That's cute. <laughs> a hanging hat. Bats and ghosts. That would be cute in a kid's room just for whenever. And the little old TV in the kid's room would be so adorable too. I love it. That's really cute. I wonder if they'll add some stuff for Christmas too. I bet they will. That'll be fun. I will, I'll probably use that for everything because I love Christmas and I love decorating for Christmas. Okay, guys, I think that might be it. I almost feel like I need something here, but I don't know what. Let's see. Is there a skinny little table or something? Just something skinny. Maybe under cupboards. I don't know. I may end up with nothing there. These all kind of seem a little big. Yeah. Too big, I think. Even this one here is probably going to be too big because you might come out of the bedroom at night to use the bathroom or trip over it. Yep. If there was a tiny little skinny little table like you would see when you come in an entrance or even what you would see in a little hallway somewhere, that would be so pretty right there. I'm going to check through tables one more time, but I really don't think there's anything small enough. No. This little guy here could possibly work. Uh, but even that's going to cause you to possibly trip over it when you're on your way to the bathroom. Okay, that answers that. I'm not going to put anything there. If I had a skinny little table, I would, but I don't. Okay, well, I think that is it then for this episode. Should I put a light in the middle? Let's, let's stick one here. I feel like it just needs it. And then we'll be done with this episode, so... Nope, ceiling lamp, halogen. Let's put it right... Here. That helps. It took away the dark spot that was in the middle of the floor there. Perfect. Okay, well then this is definitely it for this episode, everybody. I hope that you liked it. If you did, please leave me a like and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye-bye. I have a Patreon page. If you like my videos and want to help support my work, consider becoming one of my patrons on Patreon. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.